Hey everyone, my name is Clay Cook, and today I'm going to go over this image that um, we did for Heyman Talent Agency. Um, when I met with the stylist team, Chris Caswell, uh, we wanted this old Hollywood glamour look mixed with uh, Vanity Fair type lighting. Upon getting into the location that we are set to shoot at, I quickly realized that I couldn't get any boom stands in, I couldn't do any key lighting just because I didn't have the actual physical space to do it in. So that's when I decided to do something I had actually never done before, and that was composite. Um, compositing is, in this case, individually lighting each model and then taking all those images and merging them into Photoshop and then cutting out each person and placing them on the background. So for this image, we ended up with about 60 layers, actually 60 layers exactly. And um, today I'm going to actually break down those layers. Um, as you can see, I've separated them into folders, into groups, and um, we're going to go over each group and kind of see the process that I took to do this. So we're going to start out with the uh, actual first image that uh, I did, which was this. Um, as you can see, here's the ceiling, here's the background, we've got some stuff in the, in the background there behind this actual painted wall. Um, I was lighting it up with an Alien B B800 on the back side of the wall and also um, lit up the couch. Um, so um, we'll go through these each one by one. Um, first is the background. What I did was there, as you can see, I lit up the couch with a light stand um, and then took out all this background noise. And then uh, next up was the ceiling. I covered up all these lights up here with uh, a gradient and some uh, flare work. And then um, next comes the actual compositing of the group. And there they are. Um, as you can see, I've kind of individually cut in each person um, and then put them back on the background after I individually lit them. And what I was cutting out was actually the light stand that was lighting them. Um, next up was the actual retouching of the face. Um, I put I, I went in and did my normal retouch uh, putting in the highlights and then I went in and actually on each individual eye and uh, photoshopped all that brought out the highlights and darkened the eyebrows and um, did my normal retouching routine from there I went into color grading that was desaturation adding in a color fill adjusting the levels and adding a curve for that um, real punch to it um, and then finally I put in some After Effects. I wanted that kind of spotlighty look um, and that was adding in some flares and some uh, spotlights there in post-processing and I finalized with the copy at the top for the logo. So that's uh, pretty much the breakdown of everything. Um, I did mess with some other stuff as in bringing out the background as you can see here. Um, it didn't really work for me because I wanted that pure depth. I wanted that feel like they were on a set almost. So um, I ended up not using that. And um, this is the final image. Everybody seemed to enjoy it a lot and I uh, hope you do too. You can check out all the uh, behind the scenes info and all the background of the shoot from the setup to uh, to the post processing on my blog and I also included all the actual composite images that I merged in Photoshop as well. Thanks everyone and have a good day.